fledgling. I felt that explosion a mile away. It's all over the news, too. Man, there's gonna be some pissed off Sabat just howling for blood tonight. <laughs> <laughs> What's good? Still dancing, he hasn't stopped since last episode though. He's still going, everyone else is just sitting there watching him. He's a party man, my dad. Why did I dance like that though? That's another thing, it's like, animator said, the animator is like, perfect. Alright, so what are we doing here? We left off. Holy shit, 17 experience points? Wow. We gotta find tongue. The beef is squashed. That's what I'm talking about. Beef is squashed, so we're gonna find tongue, but first we're gonna boom. Pop up our wits for hacking forward. I should also do dexterity. But I probably should put one in there, right? Then, oh my god, thermaturgy. Yes, I need to do that. Let's get rid of that. Put it into thermaturgy. Absorbing all damage. That's actually awesome. I need 15 points for the next one. Dope. I just got like a bullet shield basically. Hacking level 5 or 2. Or level 4. Which means, good news, I can continue with the med hospital storyline. So that's what we're going to do first. going to go into the hospital. Again. While I'm here, I should buy some blood. Because I know I used so much in that ocean house. I don't even have any more. At all, period. So yeah, definitely going to do that. Stopping by, get some blood. So, you bro. next up for the needle? Mm -hmm. Your donation could save a life, you know. Oh, Nothing. but isn't it a little late for altruism? I don't... You offer. Right, right down to business. If you have... Blue blood pack. Very nice. Well, I don't need all that. I'm just gonna buy, like, fucking... It's expensive, bro. Just give me one. I just use it for when I'm in a pinch. That's a lot, yeah. Killed this fool up here. Or upstairs already on accident. Eat Mr. Malcolm. You're gonna be slurp you up. Oh, what time is it? Time for you to cheat on your wife some more, fucker. Nice, let's do this. Oh, that's not the right one anyway. Wrong computer. Here we go. Okay, 
Did I? Lock. Lock. Okay. So now the door. Dosage. Yo. Unlock. Open sesame. I don't think I can need to worry about those cameras. But just in case, let's hot save. Reveal your secrets. What? <laughs> There's probably another reason to come in here later in the game. What the fuck? Give me the good shit now. Cabinet? What? Door. Oh, wow. I unlocked the door and then I unlocked the safe. That is some bullshit. Looks like I'm still not ready to finish this quest line. That's annoying as hell. To be real, but hey, it's cool. Five more. That sucks. Moving on. Right, so found Bertram. It's behind the diner here. Uh they said gas station, so that's where I kept looking. I didn't find no sort of gas station, but it's all it. Okay. There he is. He's looking in there. It's like so simple yet. Like it took me a minute. <laughs> oh well. Look who finally made it. Thought you'd never find me, huh? You ugly. I've gotten good at knowing when I'm wanted. <laughs> the one and only. But don't bother with the introductions, fledgling. I know who you are. Like Nuke was traveled fuel. down the Kindred Grapevine like wildfire. And that courtroom spat between LaCroix and Nines Rodriguez is a juicy little morsel. And you in the middle. <laughs> How interesting. This guy's a gossip queen. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? Well, I wasn't worried. So why did you need to find me? What did you need? Hmm? Oh, never mind. The warehouse, though. I've been watching the place. The Sabbat has a bunch of low-life humans working day and night to move stuff through there. There's some major staging going on. As far as I can tell, the humans seem to know the score from the way they've been talking. I think most of them have aspirations of joining the next graduating class of shovelheads. Ugh, losers. Yeah, the Sabbat like everyone to know just who they're dealing with. So if you get in there and have to bust a few heads, don't feel bad. Think of it as a... Yes, I can. Just tell me when you're ready, and we'll leave. Once you're there, however, you're on your own. You'll have to get into the place and plant the explosives in the middle office to take the whole structure down. Middle office... We're in the middle of everything. Let's go. Let's pull ready, bro. Let's go. Now we're talking. Now I get to really 
put my powers to the fullest here. Free ammo. Free blood. I'll take it all. To see you in here? Hard to believe. Alright. This looks like it cracked in. For sure. Oh. I see you. Smoking's bad for you. Just kidding, but... Get it out of your system. eat everybody. It'll work great. Right? Just I'll waste any blood or ammo. You look like you have nothing to do with it. Don't be afraid to see a bunch of bullshit in a second. Two freaked house. Okay, wow, thank you. Here tonight. Boxes all in everyone's face and shit. Didn't you hear? A new shipment came in. Some pretty serious hardware. Yeah, I heard. But what? Hey, man. Freeze, bitch. Oh, <laughs> you freeze, fucker. <laughs> Die. There we go. So simple. Just stay in there and watch them slowly bleed out. Kinda cool. In an evil, awesome way. Just gathering up ammo. Let me try to shoot this guy. There's two of them, maybe not. Uh huh. I don't know what that noise was, but it sounded dope. Fuck that. Don't need it. You're getting shot out. I'm wasting the blood. Or I'll eat you. That would work great too. What's this? What's this? Oh. What the fuck? Interesting. Well, that's fantastic. You gonna bet or what? Shit, relax, Holmes. I'm in. Yo, Marcus was getting all crazy on people tonight, right? What the fuck? Something going down tonight. He knows something we don't. I know you best keep your voice. Hey, we feel, man. man. <laughs> this is creepy, man. I'm just staying here. Slowly die. <laughs> Riveting gameplay. Yeah. Yeah. It's like revolutionary war shit. <laughs> Stand in please. Next shot. Alright. It's kind of cool. Need more blood now already.
ammo. Man, I can't see a damn thing. It's too dark. It's not the first time I said that too, so I'm gonna change it. Middle of everything. Put it up to halfway. How about that? Not much better. Wow. Oh my god. Are you okay? Jesus, dude. Oh man. Are you. Oh, he's hey, joking. Shots. How come you can shoot so much harder, like more accurately than me? Wow. Oh. Jesus Christ. Okay. Just, just jumped Garen now, I guess. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Down no, no. Okay. save that for when I really need it. Nice. That's where I was just... I didn't go to the right back there yet, but I think that's where the story went. Anyway, so that's what I'll check first. They're gas cans. <laughs> Strange. Six. Son of a bitch. your fucking leg. <laughs> Got him. Nice. Full blood going into this. Perfect. Ah, they're gone. Alright. There's more. Come on. Yes, I know. <laughs> Try. Dude, so Tremere is just eating and casting. Devour everybody. Really? Open the door, punk. 
You won't. I wonder if I can get him with the purge. Look like middle offices to me, by the way. Can you let me eat you already? Jesus. My God. <laughs> Sick, dude. Just slurping up everybody. A chair. I feel like I'm going backwards, bro. I should have came in this way or something. Because I could totally could have. Like, I had the option to. I should have came in through this way, I believe, because this seems like a back door. Oh, well. I'm here where I need to be. Oops. Okay. Four of them. There's a ladder going up. I'm definitely. Going in the back way, which is cool. I really like that you can do that. Oh. Wow, killed your friend, you fucking retard. Come on, where's my blood purge? Oh, shit. Wow. Not fucking around. That guy was not fucking around. He blasted in my ass. My game for a fucking lagged when he did that. Jesus Christ. He was ready for my hail vampire gas. Damn, I strapped up in here, man. Oh. 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 This is. That's why he was in here. This is the middle office. Copy that. Copy that. I'm gonna blow the bitch up. I don't know if I get experience for killing, but I'll kill these guys anyway. Just for crossing me. <laughs> With an inch of health though. Can clear this room. Holy shit. What was that? What was that? Huh? Nothing, Who's nothing, there? no, 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 nothing. I don't know what should They gotta be on the outside. Okay, they're outside. Oh, clear these boys out. That's what I'm talking about. Mirror sick. I don't know who else I could do that with. What the fuck? Oh, it's invisible. That's interesting. Weird. There's only a couple of them left, I believe. Because I cleared almost everybody out the back door, too. So I'm going. Save and go. Here we go. Three minutes. Run, motherfucker, run.
What the fuck is that? Okay. Come here, bitch. Can I eat you? Or are you just gonna kill me? Jeez, that was cool. Jumped out the door after me, I'm like, that's the door I need to get out! Fucking jumped out, I'm like, Mario and shit. Oh, wow. It's fucked up. I just healed, man. I have blood, I went fucking frenzy because I ran out of blood. It's hard out here. To eat every three kills. What? Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god, I just shit my pants. Why is this game still doing this shit to me? These jump scares are gonna be the death of me. Go, 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 go. What's happening? Where is he? Oh, wow. I do not have the blood. I'm going to go frenzy again. Then that's gonna be the death of me. So can't let that happen. Oh, I could just drop. That'll work. Oh my god! The second one scared the shit out of me. Worse than the first one. Way worse than the first one. Is that hobo still here? I need him. Oh. No, he ran off. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Wait, wolf. Okay, wait, wolf. Hitting me. I'm being chased by other things right now. The warehouse. Your handiwork, I presume? What the? <laughs> yeah, we gotta address this. <laughs> Not experienced much in the creatures of the night, are you? For future reference, you might keep in mind that werewolves aren't in the habit of introducing themselves. I don't give a fuck. Why have you been following me? I see my reputation for once does not precede me. My name is Beckett. I haven't been following you, per se. We've just coincidentally been at the same places at the same time, mm. for different reasons. So sorry if I unnerved you. Tell me, have you by chance seen or felt anything strange since your embrace? Many, many things. <laughs> Baroness personality... Okay, She's shit. undoubtedly Malkavian. Yeah. Or should I say, they are undoubtedly Malkavian? A ghost. <laughs> Quite ordinary. Quite ordinary. I generally pay wraiths no mind. All but a few are willing to give up their secrets. Interesting. Thin bloods. They're a fascination of mine. They are considered a weaker, more human-like kindred. Hence the name, Thin Blood. But they are sired, same as any of us. I've heard a large concentration of them live in this city. They're one of the reasons I'm in. I'm in. Oh. Most of my contacts here them? report sensing something unusual in the night air. Like a sense of dread or pressure. But I'm not a native to these parts, so I can't tell if it's irregular. And since you're still fresh, pleasure meeting your acquaintance. But there are rumblings for me to discredit. We shall, I'm certain, meet again. Or never again. Good night, young one. And be careful. You're very likely being hunted by the Sabbat. Yeah, especially after the shit I just did. No doubt. 
Oh my god, you wasted so much time and now I'm frenzied. Thank god the hobo ain't here. <laughs> Cool. That's such a weird time to introduce yourself. I'm being chased and you're gonna jump up on me like that. That's how you, that's how you get hurt, to be honest. Get that cutscene safety away. Oh, sorry, nice Bridge. work, fledgling. I felt that explosion a mile away. It's all over the news, too. Man. There's going to be some pissed off Sabat just howling for blood tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Beckett. Well, I know of him. Why? No kidding. Huh. Must be something major happening if he's in town. Beckett is a historian of sorts. He's unearthed more vampire lore than anyone. Well, that's all Beckett does. Seek the truth behind our condition. Strange, because he's not a vampire. Maybe he is actually, but just what do you need? I don't even know. To be honest, he's a werewolf. He said so himself. Yeah, what happened? That was just silly vampire politicking, fledgling. No more. <laughs> of course it did. As if vampires and women both weren't insecure enough. Get them together in one Malkavian body. And look what happens. Yeah, no kidding. Now that the Camarilla's moved into L.A., Therese wants the title of Prince of Santa Monica. I guess she saw me as a threat. Funny thing is... Oh, uh, I had my suspicions. What an interesting specimen. <laughs> like what? Sure. What can you tell me about? Nine. From what I hear, he's a likable sort, and that's a problem. Nines Rodriguez is the kind of guy you want on your side, and more kin. Hmm. All right, you know that's. This ain't good. I'm sorry, Bridget. I'm so sorry, dude. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. This is fucked up, man. It's like, okay, it's okay, it's okay. Alright, that's enough. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Such a thirsty boy. I gotta go eat before I can talk to Birch and... Alright. You better get back downtown. The Prince Lacroix cool. is gonna want to hear now that all I have about blood. this victory. Downtown, okay. Now that I have blood, I talk to him again. I don't wanna beat his ass up anymore. Let's see what's up in your notes. Fisky. It would be. Yeah, I bet. Big pipes between parking structures. That would have been good to know earlier, but fuck it. Whatever. Alright. Very good. Very good. Now, we're moving on up. Moving on up, putting up a point to security for my lock picking. Very good. And you know what that means. At least I think you should know what that means. If you were paying attention. Fuck. So now that I have lock picking level 5, that means I can continue hospital quest for real this time. I 
last of that last time. I know. Matter of fact, last time I bought some blood, so I'm gonna do that too, because that is a valuable commodity, as you would imagine. That's why it's so damn expensive, too. Sheesh. It's a mesmer. Tricillion. Tricillion? Tricillion? Mm -hmm. Words. Still. Still not dead. Okay, that's good. Let's hang on in there, I guess. Outside the fucking parking lot. Oh, it's crazy. Crime scene. Here? Gonna have to ask you to. Ah, some lunatic broke into the gallery and slashed up the painting. That's just, oh, just a shame. Really hope they catch the guy. Still in clean up. Can't believe you do. They're gone. That was rather quick. Uh, no. They weren't out there long. <laughs> Shoot. Thanks for coming back. I guess be... Really? Well, let me see what. All right, here's what we got today. Let's go. $68, that's it. Let's go. So, so. What? <sighs> Need Lily's fucking diner still. Hmm. Yeah, this is Lily's stuff. I don't know why I still got it. Whatever.
Don't really need none of that. At least not yet. But I'm glad I got a discount now. It's my homie trip. <laughs> Need something, pal? Oh, man, wait! Say that again! Oh, man, you! You're a vampire, aren't you? What? What the hell are you smoking? Oh, man, you are too! Don't bullshit me, man! <laughs> Just don't play it, no, I mean, Oh, man! I ain't gonna tell no one. It's okay, man. This man. This man. I'm a ghoul. I didn't know about any of this stuff until a couple of months ago. This guy just appeared and. Well, all of a sudden, BAM! Whoa, man! Vampires are real and right there in front of my eyes! Blue my goddamn mom! Well, the way it was explained to me, whenever a vampire lets a human drink some of their vampire blood, the human gains a little vampire power! And he look quick at that kind of stuff! <laughs> Oh man, his name's Bertram Oh my god. Awesome! Man, after that first take of vampire blood, it's like the best drug. I'm telling you, it's like... Well, it didn't mess me up. It just made me feel like I was better at everything. It felt like a god just sucking on that nasty dude's wrist. Oh man! Wow, Bertram had me keeping an eye on this guy. This Asian dude who's been poking around Santa Monica. Bertram thought he might be a vampire. And this guy, this this thing, got wise to me. Now instead of me watching him, he's watching me. You know, <laughs> I see this guy appear around me all the time, like off in the distance, watching me. He'll warp up next to me. Oh man! And, oh, this I thought there was a black guy though. I want to put a bullet in his head, but who knows if that'll do anything. So I was waiting till I talked to Bertram. But... <laughs> Are all ghouls as weak as the pathetic as you? I'll Hell take care yeah. of it. No. The picture on the license isn't him. I don't know why he had it, but well, it might. Right on! Just come back and let me know the job. New quest line. Who would have thought? Virgil Crumb. I think it's about time we paid a visit to Kilpatrick. Just 
seen his name a couple times in here already. He's the Bill Bondsman. He's the one we go to when we're looking for someone. Little grease ball. Look at that shirt, though. If you're new to town, it's a fly shirt. Welcome to Kilpatrick 24 Hour Bail Bonds. My name's Arthur Kilpatrick. How can I help you? You can still get my ass, fat boy. Wow. Just ask sure, the pal, what? Yeah. Well, typically back. when things like this happen, the cops ratchet up the patrols and start hauling in more sus- hmm. Oops. Oh. Hey there! Scared by your business. Of course, goes with- <laughs> You betcha. I used to do some bounty hunting myself back in the day. Takes us- Yep, damn good. His name's Carson, and he's great at what he does when he wants to do it. I can't seem to find him now, though. Hello, caller. Is tonight a rerun? Amy is what I'm getting at. <laughs> it is my whole, my whole questionnaire seems to be leaning towards. Hello, Gomez. What's the latest conspiracy? Well, I don't feel right cutting Carson loose just yet. We go way back. I knew his father, too. Tell you what, since I'm stuck here, why don't you go look for him? Just real quick. I'll pay you. All right. Yeah, I ain't trying to get invested in your job, no way. But you better make it worth the while. Great, great. Yes. I suppose the first place you should look is his apartment in Santa Monica Suites. Apartment 1, I think it is. Well, Maybe you'll there. find something there to let you know where Not he's got one, himself but... to. Here's a key card that lets you. Thank you. Sure. I'll use your computer, computer real quick, please. To look up Virgil. Oh. Fascinating. The American government's uh, been putting more money into space. Don't you see what's happening? I can't believe I'm the only one that's figured it out. Am oh, I the no. only person alive that can see what's going on? It's because the Andromedans and the Betas are going to be fighting their war in this galaxy through us, Deb, and the American people. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Gomez, and that concludes the Five dollars. Well, this Getting girl's full. got a pair bill, so it's time for a few corpse identified being held at work. Should I say? Hot. Well, I know where that Friggin is. Chicken recently challenged several random people to a taste test between friggin' chicken and the other leading chicken flavored products. Let's listen for which one they preferred. Ma'am, care to participate in a taste test? Here, try this leading brand of chicken. Oh, oh my gosh! Is that weak old fish? Now, try this. Oh, oh, this is some good f chicken. What is this? Sir, take a test for me? Sure. Um, mm, oh, oh, seriously, job these up your ass. Here, try this one. Mmm, hey, mmm, mother fing great chicken right there. What is this? It's friggin' chicken. This is cat, right? Are you feeding me cat? Try this. Holy f, f that's good. What the f is this? Sh Nine out of ten people preferred friggin' chicken over the competition. Why? Cause that's some good friggin' chicken. I mean, friggin' chicken. Friggin' chicken, you'll swear it's the best you've ever had. You love the talking baby movie, and the talking pig, and even the talking car in that show. You know the one I'm talking about. But now prepare for the most hilarious talkingest normally mute object yet. He's Steve Cash, a New York banker and recent whittler down on his luck. And ten makes one hundred. Here's your money, ma'am. Ma'am. I happen to have a glandular problem. That's it. I'm withdrawing all my millions from this bank. Cash! <laughs> She's an ATM machine with the soul of his dead wife. There's something familiar about this ATM machine. I love you. Wow, those marketing guys are geniuses. <laughs> Together, they're learning to make the most of their special situation. So that girl from accounting used me today. Really? She wasn't like everybody else. When she pushed my buttons, she was very gentle. Oh, honey, if you don't stop, I'm gonna have to make a deposit. What the fuck? Transferring cash. Wednesdays at 8.30 in the BMC. Say goodbye to yellow teeth and spots in your dirty dishes. It's incredible. Look at that shine. Your smile or these dinner plates. 
harnessing the secrets of ancient Egypt. Now there's a dishwashing detergent so powerful, it doesn't just leave your dishes spotless, it actually whitens your teeth. Patented timerly spirit toys remove caked on food and grease and remain on the plate to be absorbed into your food to clean your teeth while you eat. Dazitron, the dishwashing detergent of the future for cleaner plates and whiter teeth. Last year, Democratic candidate Michael Redmond bought a sports utility vehicle. Three months later, there were two separate incidences of hit and runs by an unidentified SUV in his area. Is Democratic candidate Michael Redmond to blame? Can you afford to take that chance? Can your children? Vote Republican Senator Robert Thorne, a candidate that has never committed vehicular homicide. Democratic candidate Michael Rebens has never publicly stated his opinion on child pornography. Is it because he's hiding something? Would you want a child pornographer voting on this nation's laws? Could you trust your children's future to someone like that? Look. Vote Republican Senator Robert Thorne. Hey, yeah, you're going in on that man. That's funny as fuck. Democratic candidate Michael Rebens recently sued Senator I was just looking through all the database and shit and looking at all and see if there's any other names related to any quests none that i've seen yet but i know where all you walk hurry on your way to the apocalypse man that guy's tripping all the time that taxi's there now that will take us downtown Likes that one. All right, he's in building one. Let's check him out for Curio anyway. He's not there. Hello. Nice. You're not in here. Whatever. Let's do your shit then. Eight. Fuck. Let's go. Tattoo parlor key. Wow. That's cool. So you want to shoot things. Hell yeah, I do. Give me that, uh, let me read that right the fuck now. Let's go. Stats increased. Check, check. Is this thing recording? God, I hate these things. Uh, <clears throat> anyway, the uh, McGee case is getting weirder all the time. I found where he's been hiding and I saw some really creepy stuff down there. There was uh, no sign of McGee. I'm gonna follow up on another lead I got too. I updated the files on the computer. Uh, this is Carson signing off. On the computer. Yeah, that sounds stupid. McGee. <laughs> oh, that's the the girl in the poster behind me. Probably could have got that one myself. Whatever. Oh. Okay, here we go. Location. Oh. Key. Contact the TV. Yeah, I already got that. Very observant. Whatever. <clears throat> Very cool. So we go to the tattoo parlor. Now, also, on the way there, I'm gonna stop and do one thing. One thing I've been trying to do the longest time. Now I finally came, and I know why. Fucking fool, Knox, thickhead ass. I needed to talk to him. He's gonna tell me about ghouls. He's a ghoul. Bertram saved him. With that being said, I shouldn't have to say no more. Drink this and you live! Sorry it took so long. It's hard to find that fucking fool. Just a nurse simply wanted to help. 
Must be going now. Hmm? I just need you know, you know, some rest. Mind to me. Now. Yes. I did nothing. Very nice. Looking good here. Intimidates only at three, which is crazy. Uh, I might I wouldn't mind putting one into manipulation again, but not a big need. I'd rather put it into thermaturgy. I wanna hold on to some experience for a long time. So I figure out what I wanna do there. We finally saved the Anchor's life. Riding a little too close to breaking Masquerade. But you know what? We gained some humanity for it. That's what I'm talking about. Talk about. Oh. Now we're at the tattoo place. We might as well just jump right on in it. Let's look for this Carson fella. Uh, 